All good things must come to an end. Hey guys, it's the Lyoko Gem, and welcome to another video. Uh, I'm talking about Total Drama again for a little spur of the moment video due to some news that had just come up uh, yesterday. Now, just yesterday, Tom McGillis, the creator of Total Drama, 16, Stoked, shows like that, had had an Ask Me Anything on Reddit where people asked him a lot of questions about these shows and good stuff. And, however, there was some bad stuff that actually came up in this, uh, in this Ask Me Anything. And that would, of course, be him confirming uh, the cancellation of the Total Drama series, claiming that the show had ended back in 2014 with The Redonkulous Race. Was that All Stars? I think that was... Sorry, that was Pecateo, I think. I don't have the information on me now, forgive me, but... Um, yeah. Total Drama, as a show, is officially over. They said that uh, this is due to it not being marketable in the current animation market, which, honestly, a lot of us kind of saw this coming. I mean, he's... I mean, in, in regards to the whole marketing and... Uh, in regards to the whole animation market deal and just marketing and stuff like that, that honestly he's at least i feel like he's right i mean animation as a media is a business it's it is it's just we make i mean we i'm not an animator but i mean animation is a business and because of that you have to focus on what's marketable what's profitable you have to focus on trends things like that and Total Drama as a series was always for was always for uh, an older generation, which is not what current animation markets are aiming for. They're aiming for children because that's what animation as a media has always been treated treated in the market. Now, of course, I as I as a person believe that animation can tell a story, can be as mature as you want it to be, but in regards to how uh, mainstream media, a Western market, treat animation, it's like, this is for kids, and as such, we have to focus on kids, and Total Drama as a series doesn't fit that, which is why Drama Rama exists. So, as much as it hurts me, Total Drama is over, which is such a shame because this is a show that I grew up with. Uh, I actually have a video on my history with Total Drama that I made on the 10th anniversary that I'll probably leave uh, in the end cards or, yeah, end cards. Um, and yeah, it's it's been a long time coming and it's a sad, sad day, especially since originally they had planned 10 seasons for the show, or at least not planned, but uh, Tom McGillis said he had wanted to do 10 seasons, but it's just not happening. And as such, Total Drama is over. But despite it being over, we've had a lot of good memories with the show, and it's been a fun time. It's been great. I mean, sure, we've had moments like All Stars and All Stars and All Stars, but we also had World Tour. We had Island. We had the Redonkulous Race. Their Dual Drama was a franchise that had a lot of fun and just was great to have, and I really, really enjoyed it. But now it's over and it's a shame but it's what happened happened i mean we all just need to move on with our lives lives and look to other shows i mean drama rama is a thing now it doesn't personally interest me but it's a thing and i've been watching it it's all right uh it's just this is this is what things are with total drama now and we have to look to drama rama as the future of the franchise but with that said, there is a chance that things could change. A small chance. Honestly, I wouldn't get your hopes up. But there's a chance that Fresh could change their minds on not wanting to do another season. Uh, they also actually scrapped uh, Redonkulous Race Season 2, by the way. Something that had been something that had been uh, said that they wanted to do, but they scrapped it. But, 
yeah, there's a chance that things could change and Fresh might decide to do another season. Season, just say, you know what? Maybe markets have changed. Maybe we can do this again. Or the other possibility is that Netflix could potentially pick up the original continuity for another season. See, uh, Fresh has had a partnership with uh, Netflix regarding uh, regarding uh, Total Drama, and well, not just regarding Total Drama, but Fresh TV and Netflix have a partnership with one another. And they are working with one another, and in uh, in the Ask Me Anything, Tom had stated that if Netflix wants to, they can pick up pretty much anything for them if they order for continuation or a new season of something. Then Fresh would be obliged to do it, so we could possibly get Total Drama Season 6, the real Season 6 and not Drama-Rama. We could possibly get uh, Redonkulous Season 2. We could possibly get 18, which I'll admit, I didn't talk about the PSA, but I won an 18 series, and please, please, Netflix could potentially save Total Drama, and I think that's great. I would love for Netflix to save this show. Save the show? Total drama. Yeah, I'm sorry. Um, but no, I would love for Netflix to save this show. If we really want to see a new season of Total Drama, then we're going to have to, as fans, demand for a new season. Be like, we want this. We want to do things. So yeah, I've seen in the Total Drama uh, fan group, people have been starting the hashtag, we want a season six, which honestly I feel like should spread. If we want, sorry, we want a total, hashtag we want a Total Drama season six. And I think that should spread. I think uh, if we really do want a sixth season of the show, then we should show our support online, show our support for the show and why we love it, why we want it back, and yeah. Yeah, we need to get our voice out there if we really do want another season of the show. I mean, look at Young Justice. It came back. Or potentially getting a new season of Teen Titans, although I don't really buy that. But that's a video for another day if anybody wants to hear why I think that. Um, we are getting... We're getting a lot of revivals based on demand, and so we should not give up hope for Total Drama just yet. Now... As of right now, the show is over, but you never know what could happen in the future. You really don't. At the end of the day, though, if it really is over, I think the thing I dislike the most about this is that for years after Redonkulous, they said they wanted to do more, they were going to do more, and I'm sure this isn't a decision that they made all those years ago and were lying to us the whole time, like people are thinking, no, no, that's not at all what this is. No, I'm willing to bet that the decision to end Total Drama as a whole was probably either recent or before Drama Rama had started production production, but I doubt it wasn't wasn't a decision that they made immediately and were lying to us. No, no guys, no. But um the biggest thing that bothers me that saddens me about this is that as Pakateo Island being the last season it doesn't really feel like a last season. It's not a proper send-off. It's just any other season of the show with a new cast, and that's great, but like, that's it. That's it. Pacateo Island does not feel like an ending for the show. It does not... It, it isn't a proper farewell for the show, and I wish that things would be better. I wish that they... I wish that they had done a farewell season with not all of the characters, because that would be possible there are like 80, but just something that would have said, hey, this is it, this is how we're going. One final swan song for Total Drama, and that would have been very acceptable, very something that I would be able to move on with. But because this show is always going to be left hanging unless Netflix or whatever do something with it, then that's just it. That's it. We end on Pacateo Island because Redonkulous is also a spinoff, and that would really suck. But yeah, that's uh, really all I have to say about this. I mean, I'm a little disappointed. I'm saddened. This is a show that has meant a lot to me growing up, which is weird, but I really just love Total Drama. 
and I'm sad to see it go. I'm genuinely sad to see it go. However, we shouldn't give up hope. We should not... We shouldn't. There's always the chance that Netflix could do what we want and say, and commission for season six from fresh because of the fact that they are working together. And uh, there's a chance that everything could go down, down and change. I hope things change. I don't want Pacateo to be told Rama's swan song, especially since it was a pretty mediocre season. I mean, in regards to in regards to how things went, it, it it's very lackluster finale finale season. So I really do hope things change, but you never know. For now, Total Drama is over, and we've had a good time with it. It's been great. It's been fun, and yeah. But that's what I think on the matter. What do you think? Uh, do, are you are you disappointed that Total Drama has ended? Are you hoping for a revival? Let me know in the comments below. And if you like this video and want to hear more from the Lyoko Gem, then please like, subscribe, and follow my and follow my social media at Tumblr, Twitter, and Discord, all linked below. But thanks so much for watching, and with all that being said, this has been the Lyoko Gem, a warp and out.